everybody. It is day two of Milan. I don't know if you can hear me because Jordan's showering and the door's opening. It's super loud. But I'm about to change. And I bought these super cute jeans from Terra Nova. And they were super long. I cut them because they're like these wide leg jeans. And they look really cute cropped. But look how much I cut off of them. Like they were just, like on the floor sagging. And I was so nervous. I just brought scissors from home. And I was just like, you know what? I'm just going to cut them in here. And they turned out super cute. I'll show y'all when I get dressed. But yeah, it is uh, very interesting how much I could take off. I wish that they would fray at the bottom like this. I might like try to mess them up here in a second. Like not with the scissors or anything. But like get really rough right here to see if they'll fray. Because I think that would be super cute. But it is, um, I don't even know what time it is. 8.37 and we have to leave soon so I'm about to get dressed our reservations are at 9.30 but um, to be honest I don't think it's going to take that long to get there like yesterday because it is earlier but then again I could be wrong yeah it says it's a 25 minute drive but we're going to leave early just in case because last time I said it was 25 minutes and then it all of a sudden jumped to 40 so we're eating at this place called a Lou Bar um, there's tons of pretty pictures on Instagram, TikTok, like anywhere you look. It's absolutely beautiful. So I am excited to eat there. Um, they have breakfast, lunch, and dinner, I believe. But we're just going for breakfast because I've seen really good like reviews and stuff about it. And apparently it's super cute. So I am excited about that. That's like our first thing on our agenda. We're about to head on our way. Jordan's got a little complimentary apple juice they had in our room. Mm. <laughs> Organic. We're running just a tad bit late, but we're only running five minutes late. Five minutes late, but you never know. So here in Europe, zero floor is actually the first floor. There's actually seven floors, but we're on the sixth floor because they count. The first floor is zero, and then the garage has a negative one. So actually, we need to go to negative one, don't we? No, it's zero. Negative one is the garage. Oh yeah. My bad. Here's the fit for today. So I got on a black bodysuit with this super cute like hot pink cheetah satin top jeans and tennis shoes and then Jordan's just wearing his regular fit. Nothing different. No. It's supposed to be warm today. Ah, and then I got a jean jacket with me just in case that I'll probably keep in the car. People here will do anything for money. I don't think you can see. This guy's doing like a trick or something. Him and this girl were doing like, um, freaking like, circus, not circus, oh my gosh, acrobatic shenanigans, asking for tips. This place that we're going to is a way different route than what we took yesterday. It's a lot more laid back. Yeah, it's a lot more highway, not road after road in the center of Milan. We are walking to get breakfast and Jordan realized that he forgot his wallet. And I forgot my passport and he forgot his passport. So after breakfast, we're going to have to go back to the hotel and get it. So don't be like us and get your life together before you leave. And right now we are walking and a lot of the road was closed off. So we had to kind of park a little farther away. But it's okay. We made it and we are almost on time. So we just got here. We ordered. I got a blueberry croissant with some juice. Jordan got a mimosa and we're still waiting on some more food, but this place is absolutely adorable. It's like inside this like greenhouse. It's very like rustic, like antique, I guess you could say. I don't know how to explain it, but it is absolutely beautiful. Um, and the juice is amazing. You can tell it's like freshly squeezed. How's your mimosa? It's really good, you wanna try it? Yeah. Ooh, it's kind of strong. Mm. I like my juice pedal. I got a fruit salad. I think it comes with yogurt at the bottom, but I'm not too sure. Look at this bowl. How pretty. And then Jordan got like a ham sandwich thing. It looks really, really good. Mmm. A yummy, like, light breakfast. Like, not too heavy. Mm -hmm. You know, perfect. We are trying to park our car to go see the duomo we have tickets like i said at noon if you come to see the duomo definitely come and book a ticket because it does cost money to get inside and it costs extra to go upstairs i think it's about 15 dollars a person on your left. 
Arcadio Piazza Maida. Um, I think it was about 15 a person, which I feel like isn't bad because the top is going to be absolutely beautiful to see. But right now we're trying to park. We got uh, we got to this parking garage super close. Like walking is probably like three to five minutes to the Duomo. So that's really exciting. We are at the Duomo now. Ew, my voice. We have to wait in this line. Um, we got tickets, we have to wait in the line first. And then they scan your tickets and then you go in. So, like I said, we're going upstairs and inside. And I'm excited. I'm excited too. I don't think we can film inside. I, typically you're not supposed to, um, but we'll see when I get in there. And it is super busy, a lot busier than yesterday. So, it's really tall. Look at all these people, like every side has statues of people. Isn't that crazy? And then there's like a bunch of gargoyles at the top. You can't really see it yet. It's well, crazy, but up there. I know. So we finally made it to the top. Um, I highly suggest you spend the extra $3 and take the elevator because the climb up here was not fun, especially if you have kids. But here's what the city looks like from the view. Is there trees and over there on that building? Yes, there is, yeah. And this one? Yeah. Um, but like, here's a window. Let me see if you can see. You can't see in, but here's the window. And then the architecture is so beautiful because it's all kind of like the same, stacked by each other. And as you can see, there's like tons of people here, but I think we're gonna keep walking. We made it to the tip top and look at this view. Also, it is scorching hot up here at the very tip top. But this is absolutely amazing how you can see the whole city of Milan from here. And we were just down there. So if you come to Milan, do not miss out on the rooftop of the church. It is absolutely gorgeous. And then I'm about to go to the other side and see. So we made it out of the church. And honestly, like, they're about to make it TikTok probably or something. These people are about to dance. Um, we bought tickets to get into the church, but we can't because Jordan's wearing shorts. You have to be covered from your knees and shoulders. So, um, honestly, <laughs> honestly, whenever you go to the rooftop, you come back in through the church. So you get a peek of the church. We're walking around now trying to find a place to eat, like a late lunch. We did go to H&M and Jordan actually got a shirt and shorts and I'm really excited about because they look really nice, but trying to find a place. We just sat down and look where we are, right in front of the church. It's kind of crazy. There's a few open tables. All you have to do is just sit down and then they'll get to you. Jordan got a pizza and it's absolutely beautiful right here that they have that. Yeah, Jordan got his pepperoni pizza like he always does, but so pretty. Right now we're just walking around. We just got done eating and I think for a little bit we're going to shop because we're like on this little strip where there's a bunch of stores. Okay guys, we just went to Primark, which I will explain what it is when we get back to the hotel because that's where we're heading right now. We walked around, we shopped a little bit, now we're going back to the hotel, and then tonight when we get hungry, we are going to go out for dinner. Um, but I got a lot of stuff at Primark. I'm super excited and I'm excited to show y'all and tell y'all about it because they just built a Primark in Venice and I am so excited because now I'm going to be shopping there a lot because it is so cheap. So we're passing by and this is the Apple store here in Milan. It's underground. It's so pretty. We're trying to walk to the car 
and I'm exhausted. We don't know what we're doing tonight still. We don't know if we're coming back or not, so this may or may not be the last time. We also don't know what we're doing tomorrow for sure. Jordan really wants to go stop by Verona because we kind of go by Verona when we drive through and we're trying to make the best of this trip and the most of this trip, so. Oh my goodness, finally. <sighs> my back is killing me. Jordan and I are eating dinner now. We did not go to Five Guys because we're actually gonna go tomorrow. Jordan was super tired and I am too from walking around today. We got this delivered to us and we got a bag of fries and burgers. Um, it's pretty good and I think we're just gonna relax. Um, I'm not sure what we're gonna do the rest of the night but I'll bring you along if we do anything. But as of right now, I think we're just gonna kinda chill in our room and our room is pretty messy <laughs> and the only channel we can find is this like channel that has like music videos of top songs so it's just pretty chill how's your burger is it good mm -hmm. 